All right, now to another story we broke online. The Henrico School System hires within. The county announced its choice for superintendent today. Dr. Patrick Kinlaw has been serving in the role, but just today was officially named to the job permanently. This comes after Dr. Patrick Russo stepped down amid controversy and was placed on paid leave for months. Henrico reporter Ashley Monfort at Henrico School Headquarters. What's the reaction there, Ashley? Well, it's very positive. Inside that building, Dr. Patrick Kinlaw got a standing ovation once that announcement was made. He's also getting a very big pay raise. I'm told the contract is $229,000. That includes a car allowance and deferred compensation. Now, the school board says they didn't look for any other candidates. For the next two years, Dr. Patrick Kinlaw, the former deputy superintendent, will now lead Henrico Schools. It was a unanimous vote by the board that brought cheers from the crowd. Here's my remarks. I said. <laughs> I was a little choked up. I'm, you know, it was so, such happy news. I think we can finally be restored to the morale and who Henrico County was with me growing up and when I first started in leadership. Dr. Kinlaw took over as interim five months ago when Dr. Patrick Russo was put on paid leave. Those reasons have still not been made public. But today was about the positive feedback and support for a man with more than four decades of education experience. It means the world to me. It's a very exciting opportunity. And I look forward to continue working in Henrico County in this role and working with the great folks that I've been working with for the last 17 years. School board members say there was no search and the job was never posted. A procedure board chair Lisa Marshall says is not required and a search would have cost around $25,000. It was just absolutely the consensus of the board that we didn't need to look for it. We had to start right here. Board members say for months, people have been contacting them in support of Dr. Kinlaw. But everywhere we went, uh, we had positive input on Dr. Kinlaw. And individually, we each received emails. And I know from the many ones I received, there was not one negative. Dr. Kinlaw says he's ready for this opportunity and making things better for the district. I've been visiting schools and working with faculty and teachers um, throughout the county. Um, morale is very good right now. But Dr. Kinlaw tells me he doesn't plan on making any big changes. He's going to stick to the school's strategic plan. At the latest in Henrico County, I'm Ashley Montford, NBC 12 News.